Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. My name is Philip Tarrant and I'm going to be talking to you about this very late 2008 Mercedes-Benz ML63. It's an update series. So it's an MY09. It's silver in colour with black leather interior and it is in absolutely beautiful condition. Continental tyres all round. Side steps. Being an update, it's got the newer steering wheel. Uh, it's also got Harman Kardon sound system, memory electric drivers and passenger seat. Push button start, keyless entry. And the update also came with a much newer stereo radio navigation system. It's got a reverse camera. And this car's also got heated seats, airmatic suspension, sport and comfort modes. So there's your new navigation there. Much, much better than 06 and 07. Reverse camera, Bluetooth. This car's done 133,000 kilometres, but you'd certainly never know that from looking at the car. It looks like it's done about 40,000 kilometres. It's probably been helped by the fact it came from the Hunter Valley region. It was serviced at Mercedes-Benz in the Hunter Valley for most of its life and it's seen a couple of specialists as well. It's silky smooth, fantastic to drive. It's got these very good looking AMG wheels, which I believe are from a slightly later AMG, but they look fantastic. The back seat barely looks like it's been sat in. You've even got air conditioning controls in the back. Roof lining is perfect. The leather is in very good condition. It's obviously done a lot of uh, long distance freeway uh, work. It's probably why it's got no dents down the side. There's no gutter ash on the wheels. Uh, it's got the quad exhaust pipes, which look fantastic. Electric boot. The reverse cameras are oh, Hunter Star Motors. There you go. So it was purchased from Hunter Star Motors, brand new, and it was serviced there as well. So it really is a particularly good car. If you're a fussy ML63 buyer, this is a car worth looking at. And you might say, well, why is it more expensive? I've seen an 06 or an 07 model for $25,000 or whatever it might be. Very different car. They may look similar, but you're much better buying the update as opposed to the pre-update series. So this car is the same as a 2009 or 10. Uh, it's got a leather dash. And as I said, it would suit a very fussy buyer. The soft Nappa leather is excellent. And again, it's just consistent, you know, with being a freeway car. It's got all the original books and manuals. You would have seen the photos, photos of those. Um, con continental tyres all around. It's, it's a good thing to see when you see a car like this come in. It's got Chinese tyres on it, cheap tyres on it, Kumo, whatever it might be. It, it, it doesn't look great. You know, someone who's spent this much money on tyres is the sort of person who looks after their car. And that is the sort of person you want to buy an AMG from. Parking sensors front and back. Naturally aspirated 6.3 litre V8. No tow bar. You might say, oh, it's a shame I wanted one with a tow bar. Look, that's great. Um, I'd buy one without a tow bar because they do have a big towing capacity. And, you know, if they've been towing a three tonne boat around pulling it out of Sydney Harbour, towing a caravan. It may be designed for it, but you're putting a whole lot of strain, unnecessary pressure on all the suspension components, the gearbox, the motor. I think you're best to buy a car like this without a tow bar. Fit one yourself if you want it. It's probably 1000 to $1,500. At least you know exactly what you've towed with it and what you haven't. But I thank you for taking the time to watch this video. I'd be happy to answer any questions you might have. Uh, we're conveniently located 20 minutes from Sydney Airport. We can send the car to Perth, Brisbane, South Australia, even Tasmania, wherever you like. 
and I'd certainly welcome the opportunity to take you for a test drive. We've been doing this since 1994. We are the Old Timer Centre and we look forward to hearing from you.